If you are an embroiderer who loves to make custom pieces that combine your favorite designs with personalized text, you will love the ease with which PE Design Next from Brother allows you to combine text to imported designs. Whether you use a single needle machine or prefer to create on a multi needle, you'll see in this video that PE Design Next allows you to create unique, personalized designs in just a few simple steps. To start, open layout and editing. When the wizard appears, choose New. Click on the Design Settings tool and choose the machine type, single needle or multi needle. Select the hoop size for your project and click OK. Click on the Import Pattern tool and choose Import from Design Library. The Design Library has multiple categories of designs. Click on the category Pull Down Arrow and left mouse click on the category of your choice. Click on the design and click Import. The design will appear in the center of the screen. Close the import window by clicking on the X at the top right of the window. Click on the text tool. Choose the first tool from the menu. And then choose a font style from the font style pull down menu. Click on the design page to activate the text tool. Type in your text directly on the design page and press enter on the keyboard. Move the text close to the position desired. Click on the arrange tab. Click on the select tool down arrow and choose select all. Click on the Align tool down arrow and choose Center to center the text with the embroidery. Click on the Align tool down arrow again and choose Move to Center to place the design and text in the center of the design page. From the Flower pull down menu, choose Save As. Choose the location to save the design. Name it. And click Save. To send the design to the embroidery machine, click on the Home tab. And then click the Send tool. Choose the method to send the design. Send to USB Media. Send to your machine, write to card, or link. Only the methods you have connected will be active. Your creative spirit will appreciate the 100 built-in fonts found in PE Design Next from Brother. All of the fonts, from the standard text fonts to the more decorative fonts, can be easily altered and resized, providing a range of customization options that are virtually limitless. Watch this video to see how easy it is to enter text, select a font, resize lettering, and to enter a second line of text. Open layout and editing. When the wizard appears, choose New. Click on the Design Settings tool and choose the machine type, single needle or multi needle. 
select the hoop size for your project, and click OK. Click on the text tool and choose the first tool. Choose the font style from the font pull-down menu. Click on the design page to activate the text tool. Type in your text directly on the screen, brother, I-N-T, and press enter on the keyboard. The text will automatically be selected and a new tab activates, the Text Attributes tab. This tab allows you to make changes to the appearance of the text. To change font styles, click on the font pull-down arrow. The font will have a preview of the first six letters in the text. On the font list, the top five fonts are the five last selected font styles. If you would like to use one of those, left mouse click on the style. The font style will automatically apply. To select a different font, click on the font style pull-down menu again. Scroll through the fonts on the font scroll bar. When you find the font style you wish to use, left mouse click on the font. The font will automatically apply. To change the size of the font, hold down the left mouse button and pull the lettering from one of the square's handles around it. Release the mouse when the lettering is the desired size. The corner handles size proportionately. The center top handles size height only. The center side handles resize width only. You may also use the text size pull-down menu to change the size of the lettering. Left mouse click on the text size pull-down arrow and select a size. If you need to edit the text, select the text if you have clicked off it, and then highlight the text you wish to change, INT, in the text attributes window. Type in the new text, SOS, in the Text Attributes window, and press Enter on the keyboard. To enter a second line of text in the Text Attributes window, place your cursor at the end of the text and left mouse click. Hold down the Control key and press Enter on the keyboard. Type in the second line of text, AND in Borders, and then press Enter on the keyboard. To center justify the text, in the Text Attributes window, click on the Center Alignment choice. To center the text on the Design page, click on the Arrange tab. Click on the Align arrow, then choose Move to Center. From the flower pull-down menu, choose Save As. Choose the location to save the design. Name it. And click Save. To send the design to the embroidery machine, click on the Home tab and then click the Send tool. Choose the method to send the design, Send to USB Media, Send to your machine, Write to Card, or Link. Only the methods you have connected will be active. Not only is it easy to create floral patterns in PE Design Next from Brother, but it is also fun. The program's eight preset patterns can each be altered within the 251 pattern styles, giving you thousands of options for developing intricate, beautiful designs. Even better, as this video will show,
The thousands of options can be stitched out in a range of stitches, providing even great variety and creativity. To get started, open layout and editing. When the wizard appears, click New. Click on the Design Settings tool and choose the machine type, single needle or multi-needle. Select the hoop size for your project and click OK. Click on the rectangle, circle, arc drawing tool icon and choose the circle tool. On the Outline Attributes tab, click on the Region Sew On-Off button to turn off the fill stitch. Move the cursor into the Design window. Hold the left mouse button down in the Design window and drag the mouse from top left corner to bottom right corner to draw a circle. Release the mouse when the circle is the size desired. The circle will appear on the screen and will have handles around it on the screen. In the Edit box, click on the Create Floral Pattern tool. A window of eight preset patterns will appear with a density slide bar. Slide the density bar to the right to increase the density or to the left to decrease the density. Watch the patterns to see how they change. If none of the patterns in the window appeal to you, click the Too Detailed Mode button. Along with the density slide bar, there is a pattern slide bar. There are 251 pattern styles that you can choose. As you slide the bar to the right, the pattern will change. When you come to a pattern that appeals to you, click OK. The pattern will appear on your design page. The original circle will be behind the floral pattern. If you wish to delete the original circle, locate the segment in the Sewing Order window on the left side of the screen. Right mouse click on the segment and then left mouse click on Select Objects. Click on the Home tab, on the Tool ribbon in the clipboard area, click on the Delete icon. The default stitch type for a floral pattern is a running stitch that runs around the design one time. To change the stitch type, left mouse click on the design in the Sewing Order window. Red dashed lines will appear around the design, and the stitch type will appear on the Outline Attributes tab. Click on the arrow next to Running Stitch. A pull-down menu of stitch types will appear. You may select any style stitch by left mouse clicking on it. The change will automatically apply. The Create Floral Pattern tool will work with any closed shape that you can create. It does not have to be a circle. From the Flower pull-down menu, choose Save As. Choose the location to save the design. Name it. and click Save. To send the design to the embroidery machine, click on the Home tab, and then click the Send tool. Choose the method to send the design, Send to USB Media, Send to your machine, Write to Card, or Link. 
Only the methods you have connected will be active.